हेलो फ्रेंड्स इट्स माय 90 गैलन सिकलेट टैंक टू कीप सिकलेट फिशेस आई नीड वाटर टेम्परेचर 28 एट अराउंड एंड इन माय एरिया वेयर आई लिव एम्बियल टेम्परेचर इन पीक समर गोज मैक्सिमम 47 और 48 डिग्री सेंटीग्रेड सो टू कीप सिकलेट टैंक टेम्परेचर एट 27 और 28 डिग्री आई नीड एक्वेरियम चिलर बट फॉर दिस टैंक साइज इट्स नाइन्टी गैलन एंड दिस एम्बियल टेम्परेचर फोर्टी सेवन और फोर्टी डिग्री द इक्वेरियम चिलर is too much costly near about maybe 700 or 800 dollar price maybe so it was very difficult to purchase too much costly aquarium chiller then i decided to make my chiller in my home so here is the chiller which i made in my home i made five aquarium chiller versions version 1 and 2 was small that was not okay for this tank size maybe 30 gallon maximum that was okay so i make with big compressor version 3 version 4 and version 5 because in version 3 version 4 and 5 i update one by one modifies little bit little bit and then this one is last version 5 working best from last 2 years and the cost finally it's 200 to 300 dollar charge no doubt that original aquarium chiller result is very good but it work best as per its cost is very less current is high because it has fr 11 g compressor its current will be 2.2 ampere and if it will run continue then its electric bill will be too much so to reduce the electric current i use running capacitor with this with that its current decrease to 1.5 ampere last week there came a problem in its operator coil there is a leakage and my refrigerant r134 a gas vent in operator coil this one operator box and i observed that air bubbles are coming in my aquarium thanks god fishes remain okay there was no issue in fishes but this chiller stop cooling because all refrigerant went out so now i have to open this operator box and repair it and then make it ready this operator box have ss stainless steel 60 ft 1 by 4 inch dia pipe its detail is explained in aquarium chiller version 4 any friend can be seen from there here i am talking about repair one point i open this and uh, find the leakage and weld it no issue but i am thinking if one time it leak maybe it can happen second time the reason i think this is steel pipe this one is this is copper pipe and this one steel ss pipe which is coming out from this box here i think its gauge is not good it's very soft i can bend it with my hand that's why it get damage and in future maybe again it will damage and second which is the big problem which can be i am not sure whenever it will leak the aquarium water is going inside from this pipe and coming out from this pipe it means this evaporator box have aquarium water if leakage inside this box then that water will come in this system condenser compressor because compressor is working it will do section and with the refrigerant that water will also come in this system and that is dangerous so now i decided that i will not use this box again if any friend want to make this then must buy this pipe good quality good gauge then there will be no chance of leakage but in my case leakage happened refrigerant went and maybe water go inside so i decide i will not make this one i will take stainless steel box and round copper pipe outside i explain this setup operator in aquarium chiller version 3 there i use silver box and round copper pipe and silver box get magnesium and calcium salts after one month and fishes become ill that was very much critical situation so i drop that idea and make this operator now i face this second issue it means that was best same like water dispenser have the same setup stainless steel box in center and round copper pipe so there is no chance of water mixing in the system if any leakage came in that system that gas will went out in ambient and i can repair that easily now if i open this paper to see 
here i have fr 11g compressor working best from last two years and its condition is very bad because too much dust here because it's running from last two years as it is but now i will clean this fully in aquarium chiller version 5 I said that I have design fault that's why I have two fan one fan on condenser this is normal and this fan I have on compressor if you will see in the freezer there is only one fan which is on condenser and compressor is here but as my operator box size is big so I have placed here operator box so I cannot fit compressor here and I put compressor downside if we see in the freezer condenser fan and compressor fit here so the all air flow through compressor and make it cool but here in my case compressor is a downside so i need separate fan to cool the compressor as in fr 11g compressor manual it is written that if compressor temperature is more than 50 degree centigrade then need a fan cool with 3 meter per second velocity air to verify this point today i arrange this meter velocity meter and now if i place here in front of condenser then we see it's one meter per second speed at this place also air is coming from this side here i have two meter per second downside also 1.6 1.7 now if I place the compressor here then this condenser fan air will pass through the compressor. So if I place this meter here it is showing 0 and if I place here turbine is not moving it is showing 0 meter per second. So I am little bit confused here I do not know how in deep freezer that air pass through this compressor and make it cool and if I check this 12 volt fan if I place here it's reading 2.5 2.6 and same 2 meter per second speed we have checked here from this compressor out same is the input is little bit more because air is dividing from here half air is going this side half air is going that side with that paper sheet but very careful I have given little bit gap on both side this gap is because when compressor will run its temperature will be near about 60 degree so this paper should not touch with this compressor it can be fire so that will be little bit dangerous same here we have little bit gap that fan is placed here this DC 12 volt fan is this one if I show its data it is 12 volt and 0 0.72 ampere I can place here 3 ampere or bigger than this but that will create more noise but cooling will be less maybe that fast air if pass through the compressor that will not cool the compressor best this slow air is working more than that but hit and trial can be done and best result can be achieved with little bit big fan as per requirement and here we can see the data of this condenser fan which I have used current is 0.25 ampere and wattage is 36 here I can connect 52 or 50 watt fan which have 0.3 ampere current that will be more best than this but it's working from last two years after this air flow analysis I will not change this compressor setting compressor will remain there as it is only I will change this operator box you can get information from there still if anyone have any point he can ask me in comments I will reply him thanks for watching take care bye bye